So we're gonna do a review of the uh, uterus. What do you feel? You said? Uh, what I was feeling before. Yes. A lot of pain on my hip. And was a moment that I was not able to stand straight. Yes. Which is like feeling really tight and inflammation. Okay, let's try that. We're gonna review together of the uterus. So I'm just gonna go through the clothes, okay? So we're gonna work with feeling the pubic bone. You have a tiny bump posterior to it, bladder, and just a bit more cephalic, you're gonna have the uterus. So that's the fundus of the uterus. And if you connect with the uh, bladder, we're looking for intrauteral lesion. If you have a tiny rotation, so I'm gonna just release that with lympho fascia release, right? We're gonna send that lymph where it wants to go and we'll check for the rotation of the uterus. Fundus is perfect. You can go lower through the bladder to the cervix. It's more just above the pubic bone. Tight cervix, so much better. Now we're gonna go with those uterosacral ligament, lift to limp it, and drop. And so the lower part of the sacrum, then you have a tight adhesion to the left. Again, lymphofascia release to the point of balance and the lymph. And you will check. It was perfect. Then we can do to bear, huh? <laughs> we can do the broad ligament. So the top is called the broad ligament, a little bit inferior is cardinal ligament, a bit thicker, more inferior. No pull. Uterus on the other side. Absolutely no pull. Broad, broad ligament and cardinal ligament of Mac and Rod. Perfect. So we're gonna do uterus with the ovary. No lesion. Uterus with the um, round ligament in the front. We just stop in the pubic bone. Round ligament. Here's a little pool there. But is okay. Uterus with um, what does we have to rectum do? And yes, rectum. we can do the rectum. So we're gonna go just whatever is superior to the uterus. If I move this rectum, we don't uh, engage as much the um, uterus. I'm already on the rectum right there. There's no, there's a tiny, tiny little thing here. I'm gonna release that. Going to the internal iliac nodes, remember, superior, and medial a little bit, and that's good. And then you take the whole small intestine. Often they can drop in the cul-de-sac of Douglas behind the uterus and in front of the rectum. You take the whole small intestine and feel if it's drop behind or not. And she's uh, perfectly okay. Perfect. Send up and tell us what you feel now. Because we're listing again the left sacral ligament, a little bit of the rotation of the fundus. Wow. No back pain? No back <laughs> And over here, I was feeling a little bump. It's not there anymore. On where? On the bone? Here. Here was a little bump. Yeah, it is not there. Perfect. Don't miss the uterus. Very important.